Welcome back guys. So I've got a quick video for you concerning the Mega EverDrive Pro running on the analog Mega SG, the FPGA based Sega Genesis. So I was seeing from a lot of people, including Crix himself, saying that Sega Master System save states are not working with the analog Mega SG and that analog would need to do some kind of an update. I hadn't done any extensive testing, but once I saw that, I was like, let me try this out, right? Um, I had a viewer of mine, Bishop Walton, uh, give me a suggestion, right? And this kind of led down a little bit of a rabbit hole here. Uh, he stated that if I get a chance, can I load Master System um, on the Mega SG and then go to the analog options, go to System, Hotkeys, and then Enable Pass-Through Mode? And he says, something tells me that this will allow Master System save states to work. So I tried that out and it worked. But the thing is with the pass-through mode, which is in this option here, I'm gonna show you, you don't even need to use the pass-through mode, at least from what I've tested. So you go to system, you go to hotkeys and controllers, and then you enable pass-through mode. This setting will put the controller ports in pass-through mode, hold reset to undo it because if you have it in pass-through mode, you can't access this menu any, any longer. So you have to hit reset for a couple seconds. As you see, I don't have pass-through mode on, it's off. But this is what led down this uh, testing thing for me. So let me go ahead and get into a game. Uh, we'll do Sonic the Hedgehog real quick. Uh, I've already deleted all my save states. I have no Sega Master System save states on the Mega EverDrive Pro. Okay, now we're in the game. Let's go ahead and get it started. Now, the one thing I wanna point out once I started testing this, what I did was prior to testing it, I updated the Mega SG firmware to the latest, which I believe was released last November. I was on an older uh, jailbreak firmware and I just, I updated it to the newest official firmware. And here we go. No pass through mode on, which I could show you. I'm, I can access the analog menus here. No save states. All the slots are empty. I'm just gonna go to zero to make it simple. I'm gonna go ahead and save that slot. So we're right there next to those two uh, uh, gold rings, right? Let's go ahead and jump over here. Hit the, the hotkey again, which the default is down in B and C. Go to load state. And what do you know? Save states are working. I, I don't think anything needs to happen. Maybe it just doesn't work on jailbroken firmware. Maybe it doesn't work on older um, firmware. If you ordered one of the uh, Mega EverDrive Pros, and this is a feature that you really wanted, and you were thinking, man, now I need to cancel, it doesn't work on the Mega SG. Well, I'm here showing you, it freaking works. Thanks to Bishop for letting me know to test that out, because that prompted me to jump on here and see how things work, and led down this uh, little rabbit hole of like, hey, I guess we don't even have to do what his suggestion was. Maybe that just worked if you had a you know, an older firmware, but with the, the most recent firmware, I'm not having any kind of issue. As you see, I can still get into the menu. I could still access my save state, go back, and we are good. So just wanted to give you guys a heads up. Really do appreciate you watching. With that said, we'll catch y'all next time. Peace out, bye-bye, and boom. Bye.